Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to fix can't trade problem on Steam. If you find this video helpful, please consider to like this video and subscribe to my channel. In saying that, let's just jump straight into the video. Okay, so the first thing what we need to do is check if your account is trade eligible. So to trade on Steam, you must be at least your account must be at least 15 days old. Steam Guard must be enabled for 15 days or more, and you must not have any recent password changes. Typically wait 5 to 15 days after changing it, and you've got no VAC bans or community bans, which will affect your trading. Now to see if you've got any bans on your Steam account, what we can do is click on Steam, click into Settings, and then make sure you're in the Account tab here and below that you will see VAC status no bands no VAC bands on account if you got any bands they will appear here all right the next thing what we need to do is enable steam guard so if it's not already able enabled we need to go ahead and click on steam settings and get to here again from here click on to security and then where it says steam guard it should stay if you are if you got steam guard enabled and on my account it says protected by steam guard since september 2023 if you don't go ahead and click on manage steam guard and now it's probably on turn off so go ahead and choose get steam guard codes from steam app on my phone so it makes the steam mobile app on your smartphone a steam guard mobile authenticator this is the best level of account security i've currently got this one here where it says get steam card codes by email and this will require you to re-log in so when i log into steam from a new computer or browser require steam guard code i receive by email so make sure you got one of these enabled and also we need to go ahead and wait our restrictions so steam applies holds or cooldowns for new devices logging into your account recent password or email changes and you typically need to wait up to 15 days and changing authenticated device and wait up to seven days for this. So just simply wait out the appropriate time before trying to trade again. Also check your internet connection and time settings. So sync your PC clock to internet time. This is important for authenticator. Stable internet is necessary for trades to process properly. And if all else fails, we need to go ahead and contact Steam support. And we can do this by heading over to help.steampower.com. Make sure to sign into your account. Scroll down and then we need to click on trading, gifting, market and steam points and explain your issues there.